Hello everyone, thanks for checking out my video. Today I'm going to show you how to use Awesome Miner and Mining Pool Hub to mine Bitcoin gold. Let's do this. Okay, first step is to download a copy of Awesome Miner. I'll put a link in the description. You just come over here and download Awesome Miner Installer. That's the full program and it lets you use up to two miners um, for free, which is great. So download this and install it. All right, the next thing you need to do is go to miningpoolhub.com and sign up. And when you do, make sure you choose a username that's easy to remember because we'll use it again to configure Awesome Miner. One of the nice things about Mining Pool Hub is the selection of coins. There's just so many different coins you can choose from. And also their pool fee is very low at 0.9%. Okay, after you install Awesome Miner, there'll be a few wizards that pop up. And one of them is the Add New Miner Wizard. So we're gonna go ahead and go through this. Click on Next. And you've got four choices here for different types of miners. I'm going to click on Manage Profit Miner. All right, the reason we use this one is because it lets you choose a profit profile for your graphics card. All right, I'll show you that in just a sec. Click on Next. All right, now let's give it a name. We'll call this one Miner1. One. Miner Host can be local, that's fine. And Profit Switching Profile. Uh, this is where you would select what type of graphics card you have, okay? So we have AMD or NVIDIA. So put this to whatever matches your graphics card. So for me, I have an AMD card. The reason we do this is because each profile is set to use certain types of mining software. So it tailors it for your equipment. All right, so click on Next. And now that we're done, we can just click on Finish. There's our new miner. Okay, so now we just have to add Bitcoin Gold to our coin pools. So let's go ahead and click on New Pool up here. All right, and then here's where you would put the description. So I'm just going to call it Bitcoin Gold dash MPH so I know which pool I'm using. Okay, so for server URL, um, you'll want to add SSL colon forward slash forward slash. Now, Sometimes this doesn't work for all graphics cards. So if you run into a problem with it not being able to connect, then just remove this part of the address. The reason you add it is because the mining software actually charges you a little bit of a developer fee. And if you have an open connection, that fee is 2%. But if you're using a secure connection, which is what we would be doing if we type this in, then it only charges 1%. So you would save a little bit by doing it. All right, so now all that's needed is the actual server address. So we're gonna go back over here to Mining Pool Hub. Okay, and on the left-hand side here, we're gonna go ahead and click on Bitcoin Gold. All right, now most of these coin pages have like all of the settings on the front page here. So you can see right where here it says server settings. These are the addresses that we're gonna use. Um, you have three different regions. Make sure you pick whichever one is closest to you. So for me in the US, I'm gonna grab this one. Grab the entire address, including the port number. Click on copy. And we're gonna paste that after the slash slash, okay? And now it's time for a worker name. So. This is where you're going to use your username from Mining Pool Hub, right? So type it in exactly. So for me, it's Goose Tech. I don't know if I could learn how to type. Now, keep in mind, this is case sensitive. All right, and then put a dot and a name for your computer. So Miner1, there we go. All right, the next line is the worker password, which is always X. All right, and then on the optional settings, you're going to want to set your coin here so that Awesome Miner knows what you're mining. So we're gonna go ahead and scroll up here to Bitcoin Gold. Oh, I passed it, there it is. All right, and that way it'll provide a more accurate readout for your daily profit. All right, so go ahead and click on OK. All right, one last thing that we need to do on Awesome Miner is to tell it, let me just get this out of the way for now. Uh, we just have to tell it what coin to mine. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on Options. And we're going to go here to Profit Switching. All right. now. This top box here, make sure that has a check mark in it where it says enabled managed profit switching. But everything else, make sure it's unchecked. All right, take it out of there. And then here where it says custom pools, put a little check there. All right, and we're gonna select the pool that we just created, all right? And as you can see here, I've got a lot of different pools because I've been doing this for a while. But if you just started, then probably this Bitcoin gold one is the only one you have. So it's likely be the only one that shows up anyway. Um, so just make sure you select that and, and by doing this, we're actually telling 
awesome miner not to profit switch but to just mine that one coin like full time so that's all it's going to do is mine this coin click on okay okay so the last thing to do is to set up our wallet over here on mining pool hub all right so we're on the left hand side on the bitcoin gold pool you see it says my account so we're going to click on wallet okay so this is your online wallet all the Bitcoin gold that you mine is going to end up here underneath where it says normal wallet. It'll go right here. But it's an online wallet. It's not the most secure place to store your crypto. So it's best to get some type of external wallet. Now, I'm not going to tell you which one to use for this, although I would always recommend getting the actual wallet that was designed by Bitcoin gold. So you can go to their website and download that. Once you do and you have your wallet address, you just copy it and paste it up here where it says payment address okay and then underneath that you can set your automatic payout threshold so once it hits that level it'll automatically be withdrawn and sent to your external wallet all right so you just pick that amount um, put in a four digit pin here and choose update account now you're set so no worries on the online wallet it's always going to be sending to your external wallet and that's pretty much it. We're ready to start mining. So let's go ahead and click on start. All right, you can see up here in the titles, Claymore's Zcash AMD GPU miner. Uh, and that's because we chose the AMD profit profile, right? So it's, it's, it's tailoring the mining software for my equipment, which is nice. All right, the other thing here, you can see the stratum connected and it's using SSL right there in the middle. All right, and here is our first readout. So let's go over here to Awesome Miner. You can see we're getting our hash rate here. It's telling us it's Bitcoin gold, and this is how much profit per day. Well, that's pretty much it for me, guys. I hope you found this video helpful. If so, please give me a thumbs up, and be sure to hit subscribe and ding the bell for future updates. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thanks. God bless.